It's the end of the road in 30 days. Microsoft reminds of Windows 10 support ending in 30 days. This is from Bleeping Computer. The end of the road is October 14. After it retires Windows 10, Microsoft will stop providing bug fixes or technical assistance for issues affecting security, major issue that stability or usability. 14 October, Windows 10 version 22H2, Home Pro Enterprise Education and IoT Enterprise Editions will reach end of servicing, Microsoft have announced. This was announced 12th of September, 2025. So 30 day reminder, Windows 10 version 22H2 will reach end of servicing on October 14, 2025. And here's the big issue. After this date, devices running these versions will no longer receive monthly security and preview updates containing protections from the latest security threats. Unfortunately, these days, it's not a good idea to run software that's not patched. Software needs to be updated with security patches, so you take a massive risk running Windows 10 if it's not patched, not recommended at all. But they do say this, as they shared last October, for the first time ever, you can enroll your personal Windows 10 PC in the ESU program and receive critical and important monthly security updates after servicing ends, but you're gonna pay for this. So you can enroll in extended security updates to stay protected. As they say here, that moving to a new PC could take time, even though they've warned you for quite a while. So you can now join this program. If you're an individual, you can use Windows Backup to sync your settings to the cloud at no additional cost. You can redeem 1,000 Microsoft rewards at no additional cost or pay 30 US dollars. Local pricing may vary. So this gives you updates for another year. So up to October 13, 2026. For commercial organizations, you have to pay $61 per device to receive monthly critical and important security updates for one year. The subscription can be renewed annually for up to three years with the cost increasing each year. If you really don't want to get off Windows 10, enroll in this program and pay the extra money or use one of the other options. But Microsoft recommend that you update to the latest version of Windows 11. Okay, so what are your thoughts? Are you going to stick with Windows 10? Leave it unpatched, very bad idea. Or are you gonna enroll in this new program and pay the money to get extended security updates? Or are you using Windows 11 already? Or have you actually moved to another operating system such as Mac OS or Linux? I don't think Windows is that great anymore. It's kind of like spyware these days. I would have a look at Linux or maybe Mac OS, but what are your thoughts? I typically get a lot of hate if I recommend people look at Mac OS, but your choice, I think the worst option is Windows, then Mac is a better choice. Linux is the best, but a lot of people struggle to use Linux. But what are your thoughts? What operating system do you think is the best? And will you stick with Windows 10?